And it is one down and four to go. The astronauts on board the Atlantis will perform another spacewalk this morning to repair the Hubble telescope. CBS News science and technology correspondent Daniel Seberg is at the Johnson Space Center. Hey, Daniel, good morning. Good morning, Russ. Yeah, NASA sweated a few bullets but was pleased with yesterday's spacewalk. However, this last trip to repair the Hubble telescope is really just getting started. Today's wake-up call marks the beginning of a tricky new workday in space. Astronauts will replace the gyroscopes, which help Hubble point in the right direction to take those amazing pictures of the universe, and they'll install fresh batteries. It all comes on the heels of a dramatic moment 350 miles up yesterday when a pesky bolt holding the old camera inside Hubble wouldn't turn. It eventually came free, thanks to some real elbow grease from astronaut Drew Foistel. It would have been a disastrous start if they couldn't give Hubble this powerful new lens. The moment of tension was not lost on the crew. Well, this has been in there for 16 years, Drew. It didn't, it didn't want to come out. Today's spacewalk is just getting started as two astronauts are wiggling into those bulky suits. And you know, it's expected to last about six and a half hours if all goes according to plan. Russ? Always incredibly fascinating stuff. CBS's Daniel Seberg at the Johnson Space Center. Thank you very much.